Um, so first of all, I want to talk a little bit about conventional wisdom. So how many of you have ever sort of seen this kind of mental model where people talk about the founder being really entrepreneurial and, you know, the person who built the original product and the CEO being all the way up here, right? The person who manages the board, you know, and, and in some ways has all these executive competencies. Does that sort of model, mental model sound generally familiar? Does that picture make sense? All right. So here's why it's wrong. I want you to think about growth in a new way. I want you to think about growth as much more of a sign, a sign curve, right? And it's about amplifying this way and this way your competencies. So what do I mean by that? Well, I mean that it turns out that to be an effective leader when you are a founder and you aspire to be the CEO as a founder CEO, you need to do a range of things well. And really what you need to know how to do is how to direct your energy to the things that your company needs at any point in time. When do you put on your founder hat? When do you put on your CEO hat? How do you switch between those hats? And what does that really mean? And so this is, this is a good example of it. Things like product development, rolling up your sleeves, figuring out the beta, figuring out the alpha for your product, the beta for your product. These are things that are quintessentially like the founder's job, right? That's how you get a company going. You know, as the company gets bigger, yes, you want to go up to product strategy, but quite frankly, I mean, I'm a CEO of a company of 50 people at Joyous. There are many times I feel like I need to roll my sleeves all the way back up and understand exactly what's going on, even if I have a team, because it turns out that the details are vitally important to every release we do, right? Yes, I'm supposed to be here and talking about my job as a CEO and I'm evangelizing, whether it's joyous or our vision. And all the way across, on the other side, I need to be watching our cash, our metrics, managing the board, right? But the reality is that at any point in time, your job is to figure out where you need to be on that curve and to figure out how to gracefully move from point to point. <laughs>